the original cut of the live-action Scooby-Doo movie was rated R, resulting in some toning down to avoid the mature rating. Welcome to Stats In. If you're just joining us please subscribe and don't forget to turn on notifications bell for more video. For fans wanting to see the R-rated cut actually get released, writer James Gunn has shared an unfortunate update. Apparently, the original cut of Scooby-Doo wasn't preserved, and the footage has since been lost on the social media platform threads. Gunn was asked about the chances of the R-rated cut of Scooby-Doo getting released. In response, Gunn bluntly stated, it no longer exists. Gunn confirmed back in 2017 that the film was originally given an R rating, even sharing how one example of edits saw the digital removal of cleavage. However, Gunn doesn't look back at the project with any distaste. He commented on, how much he enjoyed working on the movie along with the big paycheck he got as a result. And, yes, the rumors are true. The first cut was rated R by the MP Eta, and the female star's cleavage was get away so as not to offend, he said in a social media post. But, you know, such is life. I had a lot of fun making this movie, regardless of all that. And I was also able to eat, buy a car, and a house because of it. The Scooby-Doo franchise has not had much luck with venturing into programming for adult viewers. Max Velma series was TV Ma, and it was much more violent and vulgar than any other official Scooby-Doo property. However, the show is infamous for how heavily panned it was by critics and viewers. It's not clear if and when the franchise will take another stab at something that's TV Ma or R-rated. Released in 2002, Scooby-Doo was written by Gunn and directed by Ra Gosnell. It rhymed